Bass Gang. Okay, we're returning to the Bass Gang right now. Uh, Mad World. Okay. Uh, I've seen an a cappella version from Pentatonix of Mad World, but um, curious to see the Bass Gang do that one too. Thanks, Tamara, for the suggestion here. I will already open a new tab for uh, Kristen, her suggestion. Hi, Kristen. I haven't uh, said uh, hello to you. Um, thank you for joining again, too. Uh, but let me see. Uh, the Mush. It's also been a while that, that I've since I've reacted to The Mush. Uh, Samal Tao from the Tokyo Jazz Festival. So I have seen uh, Samal Tao on the uh, a multi uh, concert, Almaty. I'm uh, sorry, Almaty concert. Uh, but I haven't seen this one. So let's start off with the Bass Gang, Mad World. Is it? Wait, what? It's the first, right? Let's see. They have. Wait, do they have more versions? I see there's like another video here. Or is it some kind of reaction? I don't know. It's the first video, I assume. <laughs> T-Talk, your hair is so cool. Well, thanks so much. I mean, it's it's a matter of preference, of course. But I mean, sometimes it's long, sometimes it's short. But it has been a while since I've been to the barber. <laughs> First video. Okay, let's check it. Shop nu de nieuwste collectie van onder andere Only, Lola Lisa, Super Dry en Vingino. Mm. Oh, le I want to also uh, always disable the audio from these ads. You never know. And it's kind of annoying too. Okay, let's go. The Bass Gang Mad World. I mean, we all know the song Mad World, right? There was a quiet moment in the beginning. Okay, Tommy P. Ooh. Who does the high voice? That's cool. So, I mentioned that a couple of times before, too. Like they enter in a harmony and all together they form some kind of chord. It's like an arpeggio, uh, you could say. But after that, they end on the same pitch. So it sounds very full and suddenly it's one note. All the same. Let me return to that. One note. All around me are familiar faces, worn out places, worn out faces, brightened early for the daily races, going nowhere, going nowhere. Oh, was that? Jesus. Man, uh, I I don't know the middle guy. That's some some. That's Elliot, right? Robinson. Uh, man, the low voice in there too. The 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 bass line below there. Going nowhere, going nowhere. Oh. Their tears are filling up their glasses. No expression. No. You hear that? It sounds brighter. They use the A ah vowel. He didn't use the original uh, melody right here. He didn't say no tomorrow. He said no tomorrow, but one octave lower. No 
tomorrow. tomorrow. Yes. I find it kind of funny, a funny kind of sad. The dreams in which I'm dying are the best of ever That's a bit more breathy. I find it hard to tell you, I find it hard to tell. So it's interesting that you hear from all of them separately what timbre they have in their voice because the pitch is pretty much the same, but the, the, the color in their voice is different. Um, first, we have Tommy P on the left that has a, had a much fuller bass sound, I would say. It sounds much, much more bassy. Then um, we have uh, Barber. What's his name again? Um, what's his name again? I don't rem. Are you kidding me? I will. Sorry, I want to look this up. Uh, is it Kevin? What? Peter. Peter. Sorry, Peter Barber. Uh, I forgot. It suddenly popped to mind. Um, but yeah, so his voice right here sounded more. There was more air. It sounded softer. And then I don't know the name of, of this guy. It was the same pitch, but it didn't have the full bass kind of rumble, let's say. Um, you wouldn't... With him, you wouldn't have noticed it's that low. But let's continue. Hard to tell you, I find Let me return a bit. Funny, a funny kind of sad. Very big. The dreams in which I'm dying. It's softer. The best I've ever More had. breathy. I find it hard to tell less, you. Less bassy. I find it hard to tell. When people run in circles, it's a very, very... Oh my God, Elliot. Same pitch. I don't even know what pitch that is, but that is extremely low. Who did that? Was that Elliot or... Or Peter? I think it's Elliot, right? Oh my god, that really rumbles. Interesting twist in the courts. Went to school and I was very nervous. I also feel it's like it's Elliot. Tommy P. Okay. And I find it kind of funny. I find it kind of sad. Interesting take. Dreams in which I'm dying are the best I've ever had. I find it hard to tell you. I find it hard to tell. When people run in circles, it's a very, very Even, was that Elliot or was that this guy? But what? I mean, 
I don't know if you guys can see this, but I have. It's not focusing right, but. I'm having goosebumps. Damn. Let's listen to that last note again. Wow. Was that Peter? Really? I don't really know. I cannot really say who is it, who it is. Um, Jesus Christ! I don't, I really don't know. I mean, the sound—if it's like they set it up like in the stereo—it sounded more from the right side than it does from the left side. So I doubt it was Peter. Oh, so it is actually Peter. Really? That is incredible. God damn. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> that is crazy. That is almost like you have to burp but with pitch. That that rumble. Uh... <laughs> That's crazy. Am I can't either? What the hell? Okay. Whew. I mean the video is not over. Do they have the Patreon here? Guys. May the base be with you. Volume two. Oh, it's Tommy P. Is finally here. Oh my god. Starting with the song Mad World featuring Elliot Robinson. It was such an honor to work with you, man. I, you, you just heard what I heard, right? I, I don't have to explain myself. And most of all, thank you guys for such an incredible support that we got from you. The Patreon of the base game is already up. Check the description for the link. And we also launched our official Made the Base Be With You and the base gang merch. So definitely check that out. All the social medias, you know how it goes. Thank you so much, guys, for watching, and may the base be with you. Okay. <laughs> but, like, w what he said right here, like, you heard the video, right? They did a collaboration with Elliot. It was, it, it, it sounded like it was pretty clear whose voice was Elliot's voice. So, I don't know. Like, I don't, I don't prove, I don't say anyone that, that they're wrong, but going off from his comments that just gives me the the that impl that just tells me somehow that it would be Elliot those really rumbling bass notes it's hard to see at the mouths i think no i mean tomorrow i know you say it's it's peter's lips but do you actually do you actually know or do you think it's him? Let's. I'm. I'm. A, sorry. I want to see that again. Sorry. I have to hear it again. How can you know? You don't... You cannot know looking at the lips. That's impossible. They have the same movement. They have exactly the same mouth movement, so it's I I don't think you can tell just by looking at their mouths. I don't think it's that simple. <laughs> 